We started with a great base, and that great base was efficacy. We know that we're valued in the community. We know that we get results. Our tutors are fantastic. And we also have the data to support that from UNCC. And so you walk in and you say, okay, well, that's the solution. Like, there's, there's a program. It works, so let's do more of it. The reality is, is that it's much more complicated than that. And that's what we've been really looking at and evaluating a solution for over this last year plus. We have to be intentional about solving it on a large scale. And we can't just increment through it. We can't just add, hey, how can we add 20 more? How can we add 40 more? We actually have to create something that says, how are you going to be able to handle thousands? We got to ask that question. So as we look at that, we immediately saw some obstacles. There was obstacles geographically. We primarily pull tutors from Southeast Charlotte. There's some variation in that, but that is predominantly where they come from. And they're willing to travel about 20 minutes to get to a school. So then we see from the map of Charlotte that we are hitting those areas very solidly. But how do we get to these other areas? As we talked to the community, we saw other barriers. There was barriers in training. And so the commitment that we were asking, we had to evaluate, not so that we water it down, but how we could deliver it in a digestible manner to working people in particular, while still maintaining that efficacy. There's the issue of capacity. The reality is, is that you can't just walk into a school anytime you want and begin tutoring. In most elementary schools in Charlotte, there's probably two blocks of time that you can. So now that's restrictive to the tutor, but then also to the student access as we go through. So if we roll all that stuff together, what we quickly realized and understood was we needed to come up with a diverse system that was dynamic and adaptable, designed to the schools themselves, and then conjoined with the community that wanted to serve but we were impeding that service. And so that's why we're rolling out our virtual platform, but that's also why we've rolled out our enhancements, improvements, and innovation in our in-person tutoring as well as we go through. So as we look at this situation, we're piloting programs that can be scalable, that can be saturating the schools, and what we're looking to provide is a template to the community, meaning CMS, meaning corporate partners, meaning fundraisers, meaning individual donors to say, what does it take to take a school that is not at grade level and to assist the faculty and administration to bring them up to the level they need to be brought up to so that the systems that are in place will work much more efficiently and effectively. So we are not here to take over the schools. We are here to be a resource in the community to uplift those children to the teacher's training, to the curriculum that's in place so that the mechanism can work for the community. Education is one of the most powerful forces in the world to make the world a better place. It, it creates opportunity at every level. Pencil Spaces is partnering with ALP to create a very seamless learning journey for students. The, the foundational principle for the Pencil Spaces platform is interaction, right? How can two people who are miles apart, right, have the best possible interaction where it's not just about hearing and seeing each other, but it's about feeling like I'm shoulder to shoulder with you. Because if I feel like I'm shoulder to shoulder with you, then I'll start focusing less on if you will, your facial expressions and your voice, and more on the matter that is at hand. The best technology is technology that is invisible, that solves my problem, solves my needs, and frees up cognitive capacity for me to focus even more on the problem that I'm solving. You know, I want the, the technology to disappear, and the, the hero here, the student, uh, to really shine because of the great experience that they can have.